How you doing? I'm Callan and this is Slapped Ham. You're about to see some of the most mysterious video clips that are trending on socials right now. So hit that subscribe button and get ready for more mysterious content just like this. A Reddit user known as Dystopia321 has shared an unsettling photograph that's shocked the online community. Deploying a trail camera in the woods with the intention of capturing images of local wildlife, the OP unwittingly captured something far more unsettling. The incident occurred late at night in the dense woods, with the trail cam owner maintaining that no human presence was near the camera when the eerie image was captured. The photograph shows an unnaturally tall and lanky entity with glowing wide eyes. Whatever it is, it's reminiscent of the mythical creature known as the Rake. The trail camera, triggered by motion, unexpectedly revealed this mysterious being, leaving online users baffled and uneasy. So what do you think it is? Is it just a trespasser, or is it something a little more sinister? video posted by Reddit user Suhit Jadav has brought attention to an incident that unfolded in a school in Pune, India. Take a look. The video depicts a chaotic scene as students and staff desperately try to restrain a girl, ensuring her safety and preventing harm to herself and others. In a particularly terrifying moment, the girl appears to levitate, her body contorting in an unsettling manner. The OP suggested in their post that the girl might be possessed by a demon. Having seen the footage, what do you think? Love to hear your theories on this one in the comments down below. A Facebook post by Anne-Marie Scamordella Cone has sent shockwaves across social media. The eerie photo, captured during a backyard party, has sparked intense speculation and debate, with many suggesting it may depict a ghostly figure, none other than Anne-Marie's late mother. Six months after her mother's passing, Anne-Marie and her family gathered for a backyard celebration, marking the first time they were all together since the matriarch's departure. In the midst of capturing joyful moments, one particular photograph stood out, showing a mysterious figure that Anne-Marie believes is her mother's spectral presence. Accompanying the haunting image was Anne-Marie's caption explaining the significance of the moment. She writes, The first photo was taken six months after my mother passed away. My nephew had a backyard party and for the first time since mum passed away, we were all together. We took tons of photos, however this was the only one where this figure appeared. My family, me included, believes it's mum there with us. No one over 40 was at the party. The third photo is my mum for comparison. What do you all think? The side-by-side -side comparison of the mysterious figure and a photo of Anne-Marie's late mother is undeniably chilling. The resemblance is uncanny, leading some to speculate that the ghostly entity might be a manifestation of her mother's spirit. If the photo is authentic, it raises questions about the nature of the afterlife and the potential for departed loved ones to remain connected with the living. As the online community buzzes with theories and opinions, the authenticity of the photo remains in question. Skeptics may attribute the figure to a trick of light or coincidental pattern, while others find solace in the idea that Anne-Marie's mother found a way to be present during the family gathering.
In a chilling video shared by Reddit user Lossland19, a routine hotel check-in takes a hair-raising turn as an unexpected and eerie incident unfolds. The footage captured by the hotel's security camera has left viewers perplexed and wondering whether this old hotel could really be haunted. The video begins innocently enough with a woman entering the hotel and proceeding down a dimly lit hallway. However, the atmosphere soon takes a sinister turn. Watch. can be hard to spot at first, but if we watch that again, a shadow materializes at the end of the corridor. This coincides with the inexplicable toppling of a nearby plant. As the woman retreats, a strong breeze appears to blow through her hair. Upon careful analysis of the footage, there are no apparent strings attached to the fallen plant, eliminating the possibility of a prank. Moreover, the hotel hallway in question is windowless, ruling out the notion of natural elements such as wind causing the disturbance. And of course, how does one explain this shadowy figure? I just walked around it. This next curious post comes from Reddit user OneCelebration6618. The footage shows the Redditor on a late night walk with his dog. Over the course of the video, he says he believes that street lights turn on and off in his presence or that he can control them. Here's the first example. Three, two, one, five. <laughs> Then, later in the clip, another light flickers on and off as he approaches it. You all see that light? Oh, you caught that, right? You caught that. Now that I am off, I don't know, whatever you want to call it. Oh my god. Oh wow, it's not turning off. For the first. Oh, 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 oh. And finally, here's one more. I don't know, my body just turns it off for some reason. Look, we're just gonna stand here. It's only a matter until I like, I either start getting shivers or I just have to stare at it. <laughs> In the OP's post, he asks the Reddit community if they're familiar with something known as Streetlight Interference Phenomenon, or SLI. The strange phenomena seemed to resonate with a number of commenters as they all began to regale their own experiences. One user describes a perplexing pattern of lights turning on and off, not only at different times, but also in diverse locations. Seeking validation and understanding, the user began documenting these encounters and invited the community to share their thoughts, opinions and advice. Streetlight interference, also known as high voltage syndrome, is a term coined by paranormal author Hilary Evans. According to those who believe in SLI, individuals with this alleged ability can manipulate the operation of outside building security lights or street lights when in close proximity. Despite anecdotal claims, however, scientific experiments have yet to demonstrate the existence of SLI, and attempts to replicate the effect have been unsuccessful. Hilary Evans, in his book The Sly Effect, emphasises that the phenomenon is not consistent with our current understanding of human interaction with the physical world. Sliders, as Evans terms those who claim to produce the effect, describe being able to extinguish a row of sodium vapour lamps in sequence as they approach each one of them. The proposed explanations for SLI vary, with some supporters attributing it to static electricity or a form of energy emitted by the human body. Others suggest a connection to individuals possessing psychic or psychokinetic abilities. Despite the lack of scientific evidence, the widespread anecdotes and shared experiences within the Reddit community continue to fuel the intrigue surrounding this peculiar and unexplained phenomenon. As the discussion unfolds on the subreddit, the streetlight interference phenomenon remains a mystery and fascinating topic. 
So let me know, have you heard of SLI before? Let me know down below. Or I just have to stare at it. <laughs> before we take a look at some eerie home security footage, remember to hit that subscribe button then tickle that little bell icon there and turn on all channel notifications. That way you'll be in the loop every time we drop our scary, mysterious videos. In a spine-tingling home security camera video posted on January 6, 2024 by Facebook user Rachel Fields, an ordinary search for a lighter turns into a possible paranormal spectacle. The video, shot last summer at Fields' former residence, captures an eerie sequence of events that has continued to baffle her to this day. Fields took to her Facebook page to share the unsettling footage accompanied by a message that reads, this video was taken last summer at the residence I was living in. I'm in my car looking for a lighter and didn't see what you were about to. Curious to see what y'all think, the disturbances continue to this day. Look where the shadow comes in on the left side of the video. It appears in front of the building, disappears at the bushes, reappears from nowhere in front of my car. Once the dog notices, he chases whatever it is and it goes poof again. Anyways, let me know your opinions. The video indeed captures a shadowy figure moving mysteriously across the screen. Whatever it is, it appears, disappears, and then reappears again. <coughs> The most intriguing part, however, is when Fields' dog reacts to whatever it is, chasing after the spectral presence as it vanishes into thin air. Videos featuring animals sensing paranormal occurrences often strike a chord with viewers, prompting contemplation on whether animals possess heightened senses that humans lack. In this instance, Fields' dog becomes an unwitting ghost hunter, reacting to a presence that eludes the human eye. So what do you think's going on here? Is this really something supernatural, or is there a more mundane explanation? Let your theories rip on this one in the comments down below. Now, in case you haven't heard the awesome news, we've launched a brand new second channel. If you want to see the latest episode, check out that link on the top there. Otherwise, there's a spooky playlist there you can binge on. Now leave us a comment down below which one of these clips you thought was the scariest or weirdest. We love hearing your feedback. And that's it for me. I'll see you all next time.